Hey, Mommy, can I ride the bus to school with my friends? No, honey, I'll walk you. Okay. Hey, Mom, can I go to the mall with Jessica? Her mom's taking us. You can go, but I'm driving you. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Hey, Mom, there's this school trip. Can I go? How long is the drive? About three hours. No, sorry, you can't go. Okay. Hey, Mom, I'm finally 16. Can I please learn how to drive? No. But both my sisters got to learn at my age. I said no. This is not fair. Hey, girl, are you coming with us to Jackson's party tonight? I would love to, but I can. Ugh, is this about the whole driving thing? I'll take you. I have my license. You know what? Yeah. Pick me up at seven. I'll follow you into the park Through the jungle, through the dark Girl, I've never loved one like you Boats and boats and waterfalls Alleyways and payphone calls I've been everywhere with you That's true We laugh until we think we'll die Barefoot on a summer night Nothing new is sweeter than I'm with you And in the streets you run free Like it's only you Jeez, you're something to see Oh, home Let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you Oh, home Let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you You can own say yes. Yes. Sweetie, does this dress make me look fat? Yes. You really think that? Yes. You're such a disappointment. Do you know that? Yes. Giselle, will you do today's homework for me? Yes. Really? I wasn't expecting you to say yes. Will you do the whole week's homework for me? Yes. Oh my gosh, thanks. You're the best. Yes. Class, today we're doing a pop quiz. Yes. Giselle, you seem really excited about the quiz. Yes. Should we throw in a surprise presentation too? She better say no. If she says yes, she's done. Yes. Hey, babe, I think we should break up. Yes. Wait, so you want to break up too? Yes. You're cheating on me, aren't you? Yes. You can only say no. No! Honey, do you want some breakfast? No! But it's your favorite, chocolate chip pancakes. No! Are you okay? Should I call the doctor? No. Giselle, did you finish the assignment? No. Are you planning to finish it? No. And you just earned yourself detention? No. That's it. Go to the principal's office. Giselle, do you have a date to prom yet? No. I heard Chad's going to ask you. No! But I thought you were in love with Chad. <gasps> Giselle, he's coming! No, 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 no! Hey, Giselle. Will you go to prom with me? No. Is that a yes or a no? No! Whatever. I'm out of here. No. If we don't leave now, he's going to come out to kill you. Okay, let's go. Shouldn't we, like, call the police on him, though? No, that's what I did, and in the future, they never got him. I'm going to save you from all of this. I'll be right back. How are you going to save me? I'm going to kill him so that you can have a normal life. What? Isn't that a bad idea? Of course not. It'll be fine. Okay, I did it. It's done. That was so fast. I have to go back to the future now. Bye. You're just going to leave? I'm going to get in trouble if I don't get home right now. She just killed someone and wants me to go get a Red Bull? Fine, whatever. There she is. Excuse me. Is your name Bailey? Yes. You're under arrest for the murder of your recent boyfriend. Whoa, whoa. I didn't do that. This videotape is showing you committing the crime. That's not me. The, uh you have the right to remain silent. You'll be coming to the station with us.
Today I'm gonna be picking out my outfit with a blindfold on. We have moved to the inside of my closet and I'm just gonna blindfold myself. I don't even know where I'm going. We're just gonna reach this one. I feel like I should look. Okay, we might as well pick out a coat too. What's this? Oh, I actually really like this jacket. We're now on the floor, and whatever the first shoes I touch are, I'm gonna wear them. Okay. Oh! This is my skirt drawer, honestly. I, oh, I'm just gonna dig through here. I'm gonna go for the bottom ones because I don't even know what's down there. What am I holding on to? Okay, hello? Let's just try on the full fit and see what it looks like. Are we ready for the final fit? Because I don't know if you can handle all this. Upon putting this top on, I realized that it's actually broken. <laughs> this was kind of a moment. And then we just lift the leg. Mm, put it back down. Put it back down. Rate my outfit 1 to 10 in the comments. <laughs> Weekend 1 of Coachella is sadly over, so I'm going to rate all the outfits that I wore this year. Okay, this was my day one outfit. I'm obsessed with it. It's giving 2000s Avril Lavigne. The only thing I would have changed about this is I wish the short was like ever so slightly shorter. But the Converse were a smart pick because last year I wore heels and I learned my damn lesson. I'm gonna give this one like a seven out of 10. Day two, oh. I was dying over this and everyone else was also dying over this. It's giving bitch on the back of the motorcycle that you could never stop thinking about when you see her. This is a 10 out of 10. I would have not changed anything about this look at all. It was perfect. This is day three and it was really, really cute, but so impractical. I had to fully tape the top to my body because it would not stay where it was supposed to be. The skirt was also falling. You can see my underwear in this pic. But regardless, it was iconic. I'm gonna give this one like a nine out of 10. The fringe gloves, oh. I'm so sad that Coachella is over, but I'm also glad that I had a redemption arc from whatever my outfits were last year. Hey, whoa, are you okay? No, dude, he broke up with me over the phone. I am so sorry. He does not deserve you. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, I'm taking selfies. But you were just sobbing like three minutes ago. Nah, I'm over it. I don't know if you guys remember, but a while ago I had wispy bangs. My intrusive thoughts are getting to me right now and I kind of want them back. So come with me to cut my hair and potentially fuck it up. I'm gonna do very small sections because you can always cut more hair off. Unfortunately, you cannot put it back. This feels like too much, even though it's like four strands of hair. Okay, I think this is good. <laughs> you know what? We don't have time to be a baby. I'm gonna cut it short first. Oh, <laughs> I already like it. It's not even short enough, but it's cute. I almost forgot to film myself cutting more. Okay, I hope that wasn't too much. That might have been a little short. <laughs> no way, actually, I'm crying. It's not that bad, right? Okay, I think I'm just dramatic. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. Honestly, I should have left them long. The next video is gonna be me selling this hair on eBay so that I can buy a wig to cover this. Please be a long time. I really wanna stare at Josh in fourth period. What? What am I supposed to do if I can't see the whole day? Hey, what do you think of this shirt I'm wearing? Uh, nothing, since I only got four minutes to see today. Um, Bailey, I'm to your right. Oh. Am I gonna have to drive to school today? No, bitch, I'll drive. You can't see. Right. <laughs> um, you're in my seat. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know. You're not even looking at me. Shouldn't you check before you sit down? I literally can't see anything. Well, then feel around or something. I don't know. Damn. Don't worry, Stacy. This will teach her. Who did that? Y'all are assholes. She did not deserve that. Thank you. I'm over here. Sorry. Oh, wow. <clears throat> uh, you're really beautiful. Hey, Mommy. Can I ride the bus to school with my friends? No, honey. I'll walk you. Okay. Hey, Mom. Can I go to the mall with Jessica? Her mom's taking us. You can go, but I'm driving you. Okay, yeah. That's fine. Hey, Mom. There's this school trip. Can I go? How long is the drive? About three hours. No, sorry. You can't go. Okay. Hey, Mom, I'm finally 16. Can I please learn how to drive? No. But both my sisters got to learn at my age. I said no. This is not fair. Hey, girl, are you coming with us to Jackson's party tonight? 
I would love to, but I can. Uh, is this about the whole driving thing? I'll take you. I have my license. You know what? Yeah. Pick me up at seven. I'll follow you into a park Through the jungle, through the dark Girl, I've never loved one like you Boats and boats and waterfalls Alleyways and payphone calls I've been everywhere with you That's true We laugh until we think we'll die Perfect on a summer night Nothing new is sweeter than you with you And in the streets you're running free Like it's only you and Jeez, you're something to see Oh, home Let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you Oh, home Let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you You can only say yes. Yes. Sweetie, does this dress make me look fat? Yes. You really think that? Yes. You're such a disappointment, do you know that? Yes. Giselle, will you do today's homework for me? Yes. Really? I wasn't expecting you to say yes. Will you do the whole week's homework for me? Yes. Oh my gosh, thanks. You're the best. Yes. Class, today we're doing a pop quiz. Yes. Giselle, you seem really excited about the quiz. Yes. Should we throw in a surprise presentation too? She better say no. If she says yes, she's done. Yes. Hey, babe, I think we should break up. Yes. Wait, so you want to break up too? Yes. You're cheating on me, aren't you? Yes. You can only say no. No! Honey, do you want some breakfast? No! But it's your favorite chocolate chip pancakes. No! Are you okay? Should I call the doctor? No. Giselle, did you finish the assignment? No. Are you planning to finish it? No. And you just earned yourself detention? No. That's it. Go to the principal's office. Giselle, do you have a day to prom yet? No. I heard Chad's gonna ask you. No! But I thought you were in love with Chad. <gasps> Giselle, he's coming! No, 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 no! Hey, Giselle. Will you go to prom with me? No. Is that a yes or a no? No! Whatever, I'm out of here. No. Here's your lunch. Thank you. What is this? Hurry now, you don't want to be late for school. Mom, you've kissed that many people? Excuse me? Gross. Hey, Bestie. Hey. No way. You haven't had your first kiss yet? What are you talking about? I've definitely had my first kiss. Come on, it's me. You can tell me the truth. I am telling the truth. I've kissed like six guys. Okay. I believe you. I'm telling the truth. Hey, baby. Babe. Fifteen? Ooh, well, as long as they were before he met me, I guess. Good morning, baby. I got you flowers. You're so sweet. Thank you. Anything for you. Is everything okay? What's wrong? Oh, nothing. I'll see you later, okay? Love you. I really need to talk to you about something. You see, my boyfriend... No way. Bessie, you've had your first kiss? I already told you. I had my first kiss a long time ago. I've kissed tons of guys. Why do you keep lying to me? <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so crazy. Isn't it? Hey, do you know where Brianna is? She's been avoiding me all day. No clue. Bessie, could you be honest with me for once? Did you kiss my boyfriend? Because I saw that your kiss count went up and his kiss count went up. First of all, how do you know our kiss counts? And no, I didn't kiss your boyfriend. I don't even like men. That's why I've been lying, saying I've kissed a bunch of guys. I was nervous about coming out, and I didn't want to tell you this way. I'm so sorry. I just wanted to know who my boyfriend cheated on me with. Good morning, Mom. I spy with my little eye my mom. Here, take your vision blocking glasses. 
I spy with my little eye these vision blocking glasses. Wear them as much as you can so you don't have to say I spy all the time. I barely take mine off. I spy with my little eye the ground. I spy with my little eye the bush. I spy with my little eye the bus. Class, can anyone tell me why the earth is flat? My eyes are so itchy. My glasses, where'd they go? Timmy, say I spy. I spy with... I spy with my little eye a beautiful girl named Brianna. Chad, is that you? Of course it's me. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I... I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. I spy with my little eye, Chad. Give me back my glasses. No way. I lost mine. Catch me if you can. I spy with my little eye, the wall. I spy with my little eye, Chad. I spy with my little eye, my vision blocking glasses. Hey, give them back. No, they're mine. And if you have your eyes open, you need to say I spy. I spy with my little... Chad? Chad? Attention, everyone. For population control, you may no longer wear your vision-blocking glasses or keep your eyes closed for an extended period of time. Anyone who breaks these rules will be killed. I spy with my little eye. So, how many do you have? One. Oh, I'm so sorry, sweetie. I'm sure it'll be better next year. Hey, girl. Any luck this year? It's okay. I'll be here for you. Come on. Let's get to class. Oh, look. It's the loser that never talks. Any words this year? I'll take that as a no. Oh, shut up, Olivia. Excuse me? Oh, look. The mute is all alone. No one's to stand up for her this time. What's that? Did you want to say something? I thought so. Oh, honey, you're home. Did you have a good day at school? Do you want to talk about it? Oh, no, sorry, sweetie. I didn't mean... I can finally speak. Morning, honey. Good morning, Mom. You're talking. I'll tell you all about it later. I'm going to school. Guess what? Wait, how are you talking? The system offered me to steal Olivia's words. Giselle, that's a criminal offense. Wait, what? Yeah, they can lock you up for it. I had no idea. I'm going to get into so much trouble. How does she even have infinite words? Hey, is it possible for somebody to have infinite words? Infinite words? No way. Well, Olivia did. Now I have them. Giselle, please report to the principal's office immediately. They know. Giselle, please report to the principal's office immediately. They know. Just relax, you don't know that. Go in there and act like you know nothing. I'll try. You can do this. Did you see me, Mr. Fitz? Yes, hi. I presume you know about Olivia's words? Yeah, I may have heard about it. Do you have any idea who might have stolen them? No, I have no idea. If you're lying to me, you're going to be in big trouble. I promise, I don't know anything. Okay, then. Be sure to let me know if you do. I will. What am I going to do though? I'm going to find out I'm lying and... Giselle? Olivia? I should have known it was you. No, no, this is all a big misunderstanding. Save it. You're going to be locked up for a long time. Wait. If I have your words, how are you talking? That doesn't concern you now, does it? The only important thing here is I found out you stole them. No, please. I can explain. Giselle? Olivia? Come with me. Giselle? Olivia? Come with me. I'm sorry, but who are you? I'm here regarding Olivia's words. We're going to sort this out. Okay. Where are we? Leave the questions to me. Did you or did you not steal Olivia's words? Well, yes I did, but it's not my fault. Stop lying. She did steal them. You better start telling the truth. How did you take them? 
The system offered me to steal them. That's impossible. I promise you I'm telling the truth. How many words did you steal? It says she had infinite. Well, that's impossible. Unless she's been stealing yours. Wait. So she's been stealing my words all along? Of course I have. And I would have gotten away with it too, if it wasn't for you. I can't believe this. I'm so sorry about the confusion, miss. It's okay, at least she's locked up now. We have taken away all of her words and given them back to you. Thank you. I'm a gummy, gummy, gummy. Stop playing. Gummy! Playing is against the law. You're lucky no one saw you, or else you would have been killed. Catch! Let's play! We're not allowed. We'll get killed. That's only if they see us. No one's around. Okay, catch! Catch! <laughs> catch! Catch! Were you girls playing? No, I wasn't. It was just her throwing the ball. I wasn't playing. No, she was playing too. No, I wasn't. No, puppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? No, puppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? Were you playing? I wasn't playing. I was just teaching the puppy not to play. Good work, kid. I'll kill the dog. No! Brianna, we're all going to hang out after school. Are you coming? A hangout? Are you crazy? Relax. We're all just going to talk and study. There's going to be no games or playing. Okay. Hey, we should all play spin the bottle. No! I thought we were just going to study. We're not allowed to play. What, are you scared? Are you a chicken? No, I just don't want to die. All right, I'll go first. I can't believe you're actually doing this. Look at that. The bottle landed on you. That is not happening. Were you playing a game? No, I wasn't. It was Brianna's idea. Speech? What's this? It's a new thing started by the government. You're given a certain amount of words a day, and you must use all of them, or else. Well, I only have 18 words today. That shouldn't be hard to use. Brianna, how many words do you need to use today? 18. Wow, you're so lucky. I got 5,000 words I have to use today, so I have to talk super fast, and I have to use lots and lots of words. Talk, 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 talk. I can't stop talking, can't stop talking. The day is almost done. Did you use all your words? Yes. These are my last words, too. Oh, no, 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 no. Honey, what's wrong? I got 100,000 words to use today. How can I use all those words? You'll have to try your best. Understand. I only had 55 words, now I have so many. What's wrong with your voice? I lost my voice talking so much yesterday. I won't be able to use all my words. No, no, you can do it. You can. I can hardly talk. I want to switch my words back. Hello? The government? Are you there? God? Bestie, keep on trying to talk. The day is not over yet. I, I can't. Bestie, I'm so it's okay. It's not your fault. I heard from your best friend's mom she passed away. She couldn't use all her words. Are you okay? Yeah. I'll be okay. Ooh. Hi, beautiful. I'm going to be doing my whole face of makeup using only filters. Starting with eyebrows using this filter. I feel like my eyebrows are close to this already. <laughs> We're done with brows. Let's move on. You already knew what I was going to do for contour. My head is definitely a rectangle. I'm built like a Fruit Loops box. This is almost exactly how I normally do it. I feel like it's gonna look really good. Time for some freckles, let's see what we get. I guess I won't be wearing this makeup outside my house. This is actually not that easy. I picked the random Halloween eyeliner for some spice. Of course it gave me the most difficult one. I have no idea if this looks good or not. 
I should have done eyeshadow first, but all right. One of my friends just asked me to hang out. Uh, not right now. Lastly, we are doing some random lips. Come on. Should I send a picture to my crush like this? Okay, and this is our final look from all of those filters combined. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't think I'm gonna go outside the house. I kind of killed it. I think I did a good job. Ooh, a button. No, don't press that. Why not? Nobody knows what it does and we're not allowed to press it. Why is it there then? I don't know why it's there, but you're not going to be the one to find out. What if it's like a million dollars? Or what if it literally ends the world? You need to go to school and don't press it while you're there, okay? Okay, I won't. I heard that someone got rich from pressing it last year. What are you guys talking about? What the button does, we all want to know. Someone told me that it's like a genie and if you press it, you get three wishes. Hey Bailey, I'll give you $100 if you press the button right now. Make it 200 and you got a deal. Easy, you got yourself a deal. You're not really gonna press the button, right? Yeah, what's the worst that could happen? Nobody knows and that's why you don't press it. We'll be fine. Does that say what I think it says? Oh my God, we're all gonna die. Hey, whoa, are you okay? No, dude, he broke up with me over the phone. I am so sorry. He does not deserve you. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, I'm taking selfies. But you were just sobbing like three minutes ago. Nah, I'm over it. Disappear and stay? What does this mean? It's a new form of population control. People can vote for you to disappear or stay. Why do you look worried? Well, Dad, because I haven't exactly been nice to people. Everyone's gonna vote for me to disappear. Oh, honey, it's going to be okay. Just try to apologize. Looks like it's finally payback time for you making fun of me all these years. I understand. I'm sorry. Hey, Giselle, remember that time you cut my ponytail off? Jessica, that was in middle school. Can we just forget about that? Actually, we can't. You never even said you're sorry. I'm sorry. Giselle? Jake, hi. Remember that time you cheated on me? Look, I told you I was sorry. If I could take it back, I would. Well, you can't, so... Hey, um, Giselle? Look, just vote for me to disappear already. I never really liked you, but... Hey, uh, Giselle? Look, just vote for me to disappear already. I never really liked you, but... You voted for me to stay. Why? You're always mean to me, but I don't think anyone deserves to disappear. Thank you. I promise I'll try to change. Guys, look at him. He's such a loser. Hey, leave him alone. Look who's talking. You're a big bully yourself. Yeah, well, I'm trying to change. <laughs> you could never change. Shit, I forgot my pen. Hey, you could borrow mine. Wait, really? Thank you. You're welcome. Mom, I'm home. Do you have your report card? Yeah, it's right here. Look at this. You got all D's. You're such a disappointment. You don't mean that. Oh, yes, I do. I think it'll be better for you to just disappear. Mom, please don't. You don't really leave me much of a choice. Mom, I'm home. Do you have your report card? Yeah, it's right here. Look at this. You got all D's. You're such a disappointment. You don't mean that. Oh, yes, I do. And I think it'll be better if you just disappear. Mom, no, please don't. You don't really leave me much of a choice. What's going on here? Dad, Mom voted for me to disappear. Is this true? Yes, she's just a waste of space. You know what, Giselle, just come with me. Dad, what's going on? It's time I tell you the truth. She's not your real mom. Are you serious? Yes, I'm sorry. I never knew she would treat you like this. You lied to me my whole life. I only need one more vote to disappear, so I'm gonna go find someone to give me that. Hey, I know you hate me. Can you please just vote for me to disappear? Why would you want that? Look, just do it. Um, okay. Hey, I know you hate me. Can you please just vote for me to disappear? Why would you want that? Look, just do it. Um, okay. No, I said vote for me to disappear, not stay. But I did vote for you to disappear. What? You must be the one. The one? What do you mean, the one? I can't tell you here. Come with me. Can we stop running and you just tell me what's going on? 
There's a rumor that there's a person that's unable to disappear no matter how many votes they get. And I think it's you. Me? Why would it be me? Because when I voted for you to disappear, it went to stay. People are gonna come looking for you. You guys, there they are. They found us, we have to go. Okay, I think we're safe here. What are we gonna do? I haven't been completely honest with you. There isn't only one person able to disappear. There's two, and I'm one of them. So you're one too? Yes, and here's what we need to do. She's back, and with more fashion trends from the 2000s that we have to bring back. Listen, hear me out for one second. The denim on denim is kind of hot. I love it. Especially in like this couple's aesthetic and with the necklace, I'm obsessed. I will now be buying a denim corset. Track suits, like why did we ever stop wearing these? They're so cute and you don't have to put any effort in because it already matches. I'm gonna buy this, but in hot pink. Just everything about Christina Aguilera, the gloves, the chain, the hats, I love the hat. Obviously I already did the braids too. I think they're so cute. Also just everything Avril Lavigne did. Like, are you kidding me? This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I have these arm cuffs and I bought a tie because of this look. I'm obsessed with cargo pants and I'm very glad that they're coming back into style. Let me know what trends you missed from the 2000s because I have so many more. These are some trends from the 2000s that we need to bring back immediately. First of all, the black and white hair. It's just so good. I wish I could do it, but I'm afraid I'm gonna burn all my hair off. Somebody else needs to eat this up and tag me, please. You might wanna argue with me, but low rise jeans and hear me out. As someone who is not very tall, this makes my torso look so much longer because I have children sized legs. The crimped hair, mwah, mwah. Why did we ever stop doing this? I kind of love the texture. It's fun, it's crazy, it's messy, but on purpose. Last but not least, okay. This, this whole aesthetic. The belt and the cargos and the bracelets, yes. I would literally wear this tomorrow if I had all of this. Comment a trend that you wanna see come back. I can't punch someone in the face, that is so mean. Wait, but for $1,000, who's my victim? Hey sis. Uh, yeah, what's up? Remember that one time you stole my white blouse and got hot sauce all over it? Um, yeah, I remember that, I said sorry. It's time for my payback. Dude, you broke my nose. Yes, I'm rich. What's next? I want to buy myself a Chanel bag. You want me to cut someone's ponytail off? I'm sorry, but for 10K, I have to. Mom, I'm so sorry for what I'm about to do. What? What do you mean? Did you just cut all my hair off? Uh, yeah, looks like it. If I have to be bald, so do you. <gasps> I'm sorry. What? I can't do that, I'm gonna get arrested. I'll help you finish the challenge if you give me half the prize money. Hi beautiful, I'm gonna be doing my whole face of makeup using only filters. Starting with eyebrows using this filter. I feel like my eyebrows are close to this already. <laughs> We're done with brows, let's move on. You already knew what I was gonna do for contour. My head is definitely a rectangle. I'm built like a Fruit Loops box. This is almost exactly how I normally do it. I feel like it's gonna look really good. Time for some freckles, let's see what we get. I guess I won't be wearing this makeup outside my house. This is actually not that easy. I picked the random Halloween eyeliner for some spice. Of course it gave me the most difficult one. I have no idea if this looks good or not. I should have done eyeshadow first, but all right. One of my friends just asked me to hang out. Uh, not right now. Lastly, we are doing some random lips. Come on. Should I send a picture to my crush like this? Okay, and this is our final look from all of those filters combined. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't think I'm gonna go outside the house. I kind of killed it. I think I did a good job. The dating standards in 2023 are literally on the floor. Like when did a date become getting in a car and just sitting in the parking lot? I just want someone to serenade me. Is that too much to ask? If you agree that romance is dead, then you're gonna like this song. I keep denying the truth. Romance is dead. But the fantasy of us lives on inside my head. And I'm trying not to give up. I'm so sick of putting effort in. I'm so Look at this dude I'm talking to. He is so fine. Oh, uh, what happened to the dude you were talking to last week? Yeah, I blocked him on like everything. What do you mean you blocked him? I asked him what he was doing and he said he was going to the gym, like J-I-M. You blocked him because he said a single word that you did not like. Yes, what else was I supposed to do? That was the worst thing I've ever heard. Okay. <laughs> hey, table five needs a refill on their wine. Okay, I'll do it in one sec. Here's another drink for you guys. Is there anything else I can get you? No, but you seem like a beautiful soul. Have a Merry Christmas. Thanks. Someone left a gift for you on the to-go counter. A gift? Maybe it's from one of my regulars. You're so lucky. I wish I'd get a gift. 
You are the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Enjoy the makeup, Secret Santa? I don't know anyone who would have given me an anonymous gift. The mystery is part of the fun, enjoy it. <laughs> Oh, uh, hey, Bailey. I am not taking table four. They smell like broccoli and B.O. No, there's another gift for you. Oh. Quite all. Here's something you to remind you of me. Me. Secret Santa. You have to find out who's been leaving me these. Excuse me, ladies. Whoa, she has a hundred lives. I wish I had a hundred lives. I'd have so much fun. Hey, Brianna, do you want to come jump off buildings with us later? No, I'm super busy. I'll pass today. Thank you, though. Come on, you have so many lives, you should use them. She has so many lives, and she doesn't even use them. That's so boring. If I had that many lives, I would not be like her. Did you want to come drowning with us? Not today. Sorry. Are you sure? It's going to be so much fun. I'm sure. Hello? Honey, come quick. We were in a terrible accident. Your sister's in critical condition. She's not going to make it. She'll need at least 99 lives to survive. But honey, you only have one life left. And that's all I need. Just do it. Hey, you're awake. Yes, sissy, I feel so much better. Uh, where'd your lives go? You have to cover up your one life, or people will see you as a target. A target? Yes, they see people with one life as weak and want to eliminate them all. Why'd you cover up your lives? I was just sick of everyone bringing up how many lives I have. I just thought covering them up would be easier. You know, most people that cover up their lives only cover it up because they only have one life and they're scared. Last time you saw me, I had a hundred lives. How would I lose lives that fast? You know I never use them. Hey man, we should wipe that makeup right from our forehead and see how many lives she truly has. Good idea. It's against the law to cover up your lives anyways, and we don't want any one-lifers hanging around here. Whoa, Brianna, are you okay? Yeah, it's just, it's just really hot in here. Brianna, you only have one life left? I knew it. Let's get her. <laughs> How many words did you get this year? Zero? That's even less than last year. It's okay, baby. Don't be upset. How about I take you shopping? It will cheer you up. You like that dress? All right, let's go buy it then. Oh, you want to try it on first? All right, let's go. I'm very sorry, sir, but it's only one person per change room. No, I have to come with her. She's going to need help with the zipper. Don't worry, sir. I'll be there to help her with that. Please wait here. Oh, it looks like you got the zipper just fine on your own. Help me. Help you? I... Do you know that man? Here, I'll donate some words to you. I contacted the police. They're already on their way. You tell them everything when they get here, okay? Wait right here. I'll be right back. What did I hear about the police? Let's go. We're going home. How could you do that to me? You're trying to leave me? That's it. No food for a week. I'm so sorry I had to take away your food, baby. You know I love you, but you trying to run away really broke my heart. Really? Is that how it is? No water today. Listen to me, baby. If you apologize, I'll give you your water privileges back. Police, open up! I'm in here! Hmm, who are your parents? Well, my parents are... Wait, dear. Actually, allow me. bippity boppity boo Daughter of Rapunzel and Flynn. Um, actually, it's Eugene. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. You'll be needing this now. What is that? Dear, this is a high school for good and evil. This is how we track your behavior. Oh. You better get to class. Hi, I'm Ruby, daughter of Snow White. It's nice to meet you, Ruby. I'm Amelia, daughter of Rapunzel. Oh, I'm a big fan of your father. Could you help me hold my books? Of course. Thank you. Hey, so question, who are all those guys over there? Amelia, those are the villain kids. Don't make eye contact. Would your hair happen to be magic, love? Oh, feisty. I'm sorry, love. I shouldn't have touched it. <laughs> What's the matter? Did you figure out who my father is? Why did my scale move towards evil? Maybe because you have a crush on a villain's son. Why did my scale just move towards evil? Maybe you have a crush on a villain's son. Who are you the son of? Why don't you take a wild guess, love? You're the son of Captain Hook? Indeed. I shouldn't be talking to you. This is Amelia. Oh, hi, I'm Freya, daughter of Kristoff and Anna. You have magic hair, don't you? Don't tell anyone else. Sorry, of course not. I won't. Amelia, your scale. 
Were you talking to the villain kids? Can you blame her? They are so fine. Freya, this is serious. I heard someone wants to steal her hair. You can't trust the villain kids. Don't talk to them. Okay, I won't. Well, well. If it isn't Rapunzel's daughter. Stop it. You stay away from me and my hair. Take it easy, love. I was just going to ask you to come to the spring ball with me. I'm already going to the ball with someone else. And who might that be? It's, um... It's me. I'm Thomas, son of Sleeping Beauty. I'm the son of Sleeping Beauty and Prince Philip. Really? I didn't think they had a son. Well, obviously, they do. So if you'll excuse us, pirate, we're going to the ball. I'm really glad we met. Me too. Your hair is beautiful. You look just like your mom. Thanks. Is something wrong, Amelia? What's the matter? Well, it's just I thought my scale would move more towards good since I've been hanging out with you for so long. Come here, let me tell you a secret. I'm not actually a prince. <laughs> Let me go, you jerk! Who are you the son of anyway? I'm the son of the villain Hans, and I need you to sing me the song that activates your powers. I should have known by the red hair, and I am not singing you that song. Okay. Don't sing, and I cut off all your hair. No. <laughs> Why do you need my healing powers? Because Elsa's daughter froze my heart, and only your powers can heal it. I don't have much time, so start singing. Go on, sing. You should know that my hair's magic isn't as strong as my mother's. It doesn't matter, now say the words, I'm running out of time. Make the clock open. What? Speech? What's this? It's a new thing started by the government. You're given a certain amount of words a day, and you must use all of them, or else. Well, I only have 18 words today. That shouldn't be hard to use. Brianna, how many words do you need to use today? 18. Wow, you're so lucky. I got 5,000 words I have to use today, so I have to talk super fast and I have to use lots and lots of words. Talk, 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 talk. I can't stop talking, can't stop talking. The day's almost done. Did you use all your words? Yes. These are my last words, too. Oh, no, 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 no. Honey, what's wrong? I got 100,000 words to use today. How can I use all those words? You'll have to try your best. Dad, I only had 55 words, now I have so many. What's wrong with your voice? I lost my voice talking so much yesterday. I won't be able to use all my words. No, no, you can do it. You can. I can hardly talk. I want to switch my words back. Hello? The government? Are you there? God? Bestie, keep on trying to talk. The day is not over yet. I, I can't. Bestie, I'm so sorry. I love you. It's okay. It's not your fault. I heard from your best friend's mom she passed away. She couldn't use all her words. Are you okay? Yeah. I'll be okay. Your soulmate heart magnet came in. Yay! This isn't a heart. It will only make a heart with your soulmate. The magnetic force will pull you towards him, helping you find your soulmate. Wow. All right, kids. Time to finger paint. Yay! My heart necklace is making a noise. The magnetic force pulling you towards your soulmate. <laughs> Ow. Your soulmate must have been somewhere close. Too bad there was a wall in the way. What's going on? My soulmate must be near. Take me to him. Hey, Bree, where are you off to? Can I come with? My necklace is taking me to my soulmate. <laughs> Why is it pulling me to the floor? Girl, are you okay? I found the other half of my necklace. I didn't find him. Oh no, your soulmate must have lost his necklace. I found the other half of my necklace, but I didn't find him. Oh no, your soulmate must have lost his necklace. We have to find out who it is. I need to make an announcement. No, you will not. Attention everyone, there has been a missing soulmate heart magnet found in the hallway. If anyone is missing their soulmate magnet, come to the office immediately. Get that back to me. You are in big trouble. I heard you guys found a soulmate magnet. I lost mine. Really? You must be my soulmate then. Yeah, I lost it back when I was six years old. Six? What? My soulmate would have lost his magnet in high school, not when he was six. No one else has been bored for missing magnet. 
Maybe I'll never find my soulmate. I hear a soulmate magnet was found. I lost mine last time I was here visiting the school. <gasps> the prince is your soulmate! You're my soulmate? Come on, please give me blue. Mom will disown me if I get red. Pink? What the hell is pink? Why are you wearing that shirt? Oh, because that's the color I was assigned. You need to go take it off right now. What? Why? You cannot be walking around wearing pink. Go put on blue instead. Okay, jeez. Is this better? Yeah, nobody will be able to tell now. Okay, good. Oh, Bailey, you got blue too? Um, yeah, I did. Why did you say it like that? You seem nervous. Like what? I'm not nervous. I heard that Martha got the color purple. Like what? <laughs> Purple? That's crazy. What does that mean? I don't know, but they said they're gonna kill anyone with a different color. They're gonna what? Um, yeah, you didn't know that? Are you okay? No, I'm fine. I just hope that nobody got pink. That's the worst color of all. What did you say? If we don't leave now, he's gonna come out to kill you. Okay, let's go. Shouldn't we, like, call the police on him, though? No, that's what I did, and in the future, they never got him. I'm gonna save you from all of this. I'll be right back. How are you going to save me? I'm going to kill him so that you can have a normal life. What? Isn't that a bad idea? Of course not. It'll be fine. Okay, I did it. It's done. That was so fast. I have to go back to the future now. Bye. You're just going to leave? I'm going to get in trouble if I don't get home right now. She just killed someone and wants me to go get a Red Bull? Fine, whatever. There she is. Excuse me. Is your name Bailey? Yes. You're under arrest for the murder of your recent boyfriend. Whoa.